50 Filipinas will vie for the chance to represent the Philippines in this year's Miss Universe pageant. Let's know more about them from Pat Fernandez. We're now here at the press presentation of Bilibini Pilipinas 2013. Pageant enthusiasts are all excited as Bilibini Pilipinas celebrates its golden anniversary. Let's check it out. Fifty young Filipinas were introduced as official candidates of the Bilibili Filipinas Beauty Pageant, which is celebrating its golden milestone this year during the press presentation held in Makati City yesterday. The finalists, who come from different corners of the Philippines and from abroad, will vie for the following crowns. Miss Universe Philippines 2013, Bilibining Filipinas International 2013, and Bilibining Filipinas Tourism 2013. Okay, so what can we expect about this year's batch? Um, this year's batch, Menjo, is strong. They're very strong. A lot of beautiful girls. We have more girls this year. It's 50. So the people will be seeing a lot more of the best of the Filipina. Since 1964, the Bidibidi Filipinas Charities Incorporated, or BPCI, has been the country's discoverer and trainer of young ladies who represent the Philippines in several international beauty tilts. I feel that uh, through 50 years of uh, Binibini Filipinas contests and charities, uh, we are getting ready to celebrate this big year. And um, the, as you have heard, the candidates are uh, superb, they are beautiful, and it's going to be a big challenge uh, to get the winners. Among the prominent winners of the pageant are Miss Universe 1969 Gloria Diaz, Miss International 1970 Aurora Pihuan, Miss Universe 1973 Margie Moran, Miss International 1979 Melanie Marquez, Miss World 1993 Second Princess Rufa Gutierrez, Miss Universe 1999 First Runner Up Miriam Kiambao, Miss International 2005 Precious Lara Kigaman, Miss Universe 2010 Fourth Runner Up Venus Ra, Miss Universe 2011 Third Runner Up Shamsi Sup Sup, and Miss Universe 2012 first runner-up, Janine Marie Tugonon. I believe that we have winners in this batch. I believe that this year just might be our Miss Universe year. The candidates will have a grand parade on April 5 at the Araneta Coliseum grounds. The grand coronation night will be held on April 14, also at the same venue. All bustling with energy and determination, the judges will surely have a hard time selecting this year's batch of queens. This is Pat Fernandez for Solar News. Emily, I have to say, hands down, look, my hands are down. <laughs> Filipinas are the most beautiful women in the world. Of course. Bar none. <laughs> and the guys agree. Okay. Of course they do. They're also happy day break for and today. smiling. Oh, yeah. Yeah, everybody's uh, refreshed this morning. Upbeat. <laughs> <laughs> that's our solar day break for today. Join us again tomorrow for a fresh look at big stories. You can also send us your comments and early morning photos at daybreak at solartv.ph. This is Solar Daybreak on the Solar News Channel. Magandang umaga po. Salamat.